Hi, it's Elaine from The Sewing Basket in Plymouth, Wisconsin. I'm just going to do a quick video on how to join two pieces of scrap batting. This works great when you have scrap left over from large projects and smaller projects to work on. You always have jagged edges from what you cut previously. The trick is to get a straight edge between the two pieces to be able to fuse it with your batting tape. What you're going to do is just overlap the two pieces and use a straight edge and your rotary cutter and cut a smooth edge between the two pieces. This is scrap and this is scrap, but now the two pieces match up perfectly with no space in between. Then you're going to go to your ironing board, lay the two pieces right next to each other they will line up just right. Take a piece of batting tape, cut it to length, lay it right over the seam, take your little iron and press. And now you have one connected piece of batting. You also have the option of, rather than using batting tape, you can use a zigzag or a triple zigzag stitch to sew that seam.